for this you need a fingerprint scanner it is DY50 as you can see it has six pins but we need only four of them the first four that is ground RX TX and 3.3 volt and then we need Arduino this is solenoid lock and to drive this we will use a relay module so this is the thing we need to make this project first we need to authorize our fingers we can add 127 fingers on this for now I will authorize only two fingers that is my right hand thumb and the middle finger of the right hand so for this we need to connect the ground pin of this sensor we need to connect this to the ground of Arduino the 3.3 volt of this sensor to the Arduino 3.3 volt the TX pin of the sensor to the pin number 2 and RX pin to pin number 3 now we need to connect our system to the Arduino For this we need to install one library, go to sketch, include library, manage libraries. Type fingerprint. We need to install this one. Now close. Now go to file, examples, add a fruit fingerprint, now enroll. So this is the program. Now we have to upload this one. It is uploaded. After uploading, turn on the serial monitor. As we can store 127 fingers, so it means it has 127 IDs. We will store our first finger to the ID 1. So type 1 here and now send. After this, put a finger on this. Image is taken. Now remove. Again put. As you can see, the ID 1 is stored. Now again, now again if you want to store another finger then you have to type 2. Now send. It is searching for another finger. Now I am putting my middle finger. Now remove. Again we have to put it the ID2 is stored. So this is how you can store up to 127 fingers. After storing your finger, now you have to upload another program. This is the program. Now upload this. Now you can remove your system. Now we have to complete our remaining connection. In this relay module, we have three pins, input, ground and VCC. The ground will go to the ground of the Arduino. VCC will be connected to the 5 volt pin of Arduino. and the input it will be connected to the pin number 4 of Arduino the digital pin 4 ok so this is how you have to connect your relay now here it is solenoid lock in this side of the relay this is normally close the middle one is common and the third one normally open 
the positive pin of the solenoid I am connecting this to the middle pin of the relay module that is with the common pin I will connect another wire to the normally open pin now I will take a 12 volt battery it is 12 volt the negative pin of the solenoid I am connecting it to the negative pin of the battery the another pin which is connected to the normally open pin I am connecting this to the positive pin of the battery now to power this circuit I am using a jack like this the positive pin of this I am connecting with the positive and the negative and the negative with negative now we are getting here 12 volt and I will put it here now our circuit is turned on this is the lock position and when I put my authorized finger on this it gets unlocked and it will unlock for 5 seconds another authorized finger so this is how it works if I put unauthorized finger see no action again authorized finger it works So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.